Hello and welcome to the 8th race of the season of the IRA Monster Energy Super Speedway Series. On the pool we got Jerry Garris, second is um, Caden Klein, third is Austin Ogo, fourth is Pichu, fifth is Jake Cole, sixth is Jake Williams, seventh is Zach Flickinger, eighth is Jeffrey Buckeye, ninth is Jake York, and completing the top ten is Zachary Taylor. Here's the rest of your starting lineup. Let's look at your starting lineup, and we have been above draft before, not with this, but both. Oh, excuse me. The Nationwide and Cup here, and uh, they just gave the command just right now. So these Trans Am cars, this is the first time they've ever came here. And we'll see what they get to do here. So I, I don't know what to expect. I mean, for a first time here, I just, I don't know. Oh, and Ty Dodd didn't even get to go, and then he finally did there. Jerry Garrett, how's this be for him to win the race? Because this is his second pole that he has that he has uh, got this season. He got the pole last uh, race at uh, Fake Street. Oh, and a car down the below the apron, and that's Chris Washer. Something is wrong on that 64. If I can get to him. Pace car immediately shoots down left. Washer's joined the pace car. Here we go. Green flag is out at Bump Draft in. It's so weird, Super Speedway. It's kind of, it's like it's a mix of Texas and uh, um, I'm trying to think of the other track that uh, what it is, but uh, like bigger. It, it, it's just unbelievable how these cars are. Jerry Garrett got some good start right now, and here comes Austin Ogo. He would really love a good finish right now. See, this is like Pocono because it's like a tri-turn kind of track. So, it's a different kind of super speedway there. Oh, boy. Alrighty. Jeffrey Buckeye lean on Jacob York. That is not good for York. He is in a bad position. Now, these cars were like that in both the Nationwide and the Cup where the cars. With the major lag right there. If you're, if you're in the middle, you're in the worst place to be, especially if you're on the middle low line. Right where York was, like where Lawler's right now. Oh, oh, there they go, they're wrecking, they're wrecking. Oh my God, Tony Blazer, William Flickinger. Oh my God, that was a huge pile. Richard Johnson, William Fick, Flickinger are like synchronized flipping. Oh, they come to rest, and I believe Reese got a little bit of damage there. Jake Williams has got some damage. Luke Walker, Devin Whitson. Lawson, Daniel Day, Josh James, and you hear that? It's my phone. Holy shit, two cars just flew in the air. I saw Tony Blazer and uh, William Flickinger flying, though. Oh, boy. Take a look at our first caution of the day. Uh, your leader is Seth Cole. Well, this is as simple as it can be right here. Five wide, Fralick, Walker, Austin, Flickinger. But they were leaning four wide, though, and that's what started the wreck. And Fralick, I just, or no, not Fralick, I mean um, Luke Walker there. Oh, Flanagan got into Fralick there. Hmm. Oh, my God. i got to go back a little bit and show you frame by frame. Oh, lost. Uh, watch the impact. On the frame by frame, right here, and then watch Tony Blazer and William Flickinger. They just soar into the air, and then William Flickinger and, and uh, Tony Blazer. Man, that well something happened. Oh, Richard got nailed by William or by William Flickinger, and then Richard Johnson. Boy, oh boy, Richard.
Richard Just and William Flickinger synchronized flipping. Oh boy, I don't know who had the worst impact. The good news for both of those drivers, they came to rest on all fours. So I hope they're okay. I don't know about Anthony Reese. Let's see if Reese made it through. Half Tim Walsh right there. Oh, he's going to clip him. Or slightly went around. He actually got away with very minimal damage. So, lucky break for Anthony Reese in the 71. So, that was what happened. Let's take you back to the green. We are back, and we have a few retirees. Drivers out of this race are the 9 of Luke Walker. 86 of William Flickinger, 60 Richard Johns, which is a good news for them, they're okay, as well as Tony Blazer in the three. And Drew Austin is also retired. Daniel Day and Jake Williams are two laps down. And both are still in the pits. Oh, Fralick just blew up. Tim Fralick, well, his day goes from bad to worse. He blew up in the 33rd position. Give you a quick top 10 rundown. Seth Full. Um, Justin Talapass, Eugene Demex, Kyle Rose, Jacob York, Chris Dollerton, James Silverfox, Henry Nova, Jacob Lawler, and Justin Tal or excuse me, Jake Cole completes the top ten. Top twenty is completed by James Waltz, Henry Buckeye, Austin Ogo, Jeffrey Buckeye, uh, Zachary Taylor, William or excuse me, Zach Flickinger, Madison Sieber, Jerry Guerra, the full sitter. Peyton Klein and Pichu. Pace car shoots down the pit road. Wow, he shot down there. Here we go. Getting ready to take it back to the green. Green flag's back out. Because we're on lap 7 to 12 right now. Well, I'll tell you something. Seth Cole has just had a miserable season. He's just been in pretty much almost every wreck. At least, ever, like, once a wreck every race. Right now, he's doing very, very well in the lead. Got to hold off Kyle Pass, Kyle Rose, even Jacob York, who's also had a bad season there. Here comes Kyle Rose to the fray. Kyle Rose has never won a race in any of my series before. How would this be if he wins this? And that goes the same for Jacob York right there in the 27. Here comes James Silverfox, the 21, the outback runner up. He's moving. Look who's moving up. James Qualls, Henry Nova. How about Austin Ogo and Zachary Taylor? Both those guys having great runs right now. Henry Buckeye in the four. That's a good run there. Zachary Taylor. Wow, look at uh, Austin Ogo. Speaking of which, the other Ogo, Dylan, he's right there hanging in there. So he's doing really, really well. Dalton's in the mix, too. And here comes Henry. No, oh, they just crashed hard there. Oh, my God, York. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, we got to stay here because this does not look good. This does not look good. Oh, I don't like what this is going right here. Oh, and they settle it out. Oh, boy. Seth Cole's going to lose the lead. But here comes Zachary Taylor to the lead. Zachary Taylor. Here comes Zach Flickinger to the lead. Flickinger trying to take the lead off the corner here. Oh, Henry Buckeye is not in a good position. But coming to the stripe, who's it going to be? Zachary Taylor. Oh, Jerry Garrett's in the pits. And Jacob Lawler was in the top ten from the start. He's involved. Oh, Chris Washer involved. Mike Flanagan. Ty Nunn destroyed them. But uh, Dylan Young's back in crunch. Jeff James, he's involved. Oh, my God, his car's destroyed on the front. Jake Cole may have had a piece of it. He probably just spun out. Oh, he's got some back-end damage, actually. York, we saw him around. Austin Ogo, we saw him around. Oh, Sosnowski, back-end damage for him. And York just literally ran to Austin Ogo right there. Fair bit. Oh, my God, that was a big pileup right there. And with this many laps, I don't know. I think Zachary Taylor may have just won this race. So let's take a look at the uh, caution, and uh, we'll see if we'll get back to green. Your leader is Zachary Taylor. Simple what's going to happen, and Jake Cole did was the cause of this. Take a look here. Cole's going to get into Ogo in New York. Ogo is going to fly in the air. Surprisingly, he, he landed on Jacob York, which York actually continued. And here come the other cars coming out of, into the fray. Some of them just did not use the brakes at all. And unfortunately, well, 
Oh man, they paid the price, and uh, man, that was a vicious hit there. And there's Ogo there, and oh boy, just a lot of cars getting involved, especially for the pole sitter Jerry Guerra. That is a tough blow to him. So, that's one of the caution again. Let's see if we're going to get back to green. Ladies and gentlemen, we are not going to go back to green, and it looks like Zachary Taylor may have just won this race. Unbelievable. Zachary Taylor is going to probably have his first career win in the IRA Monster Energy Super Speedway Series here at Bump Drafton. As you can see, the lights are still on, and we're not going to go back to green. We are on the final lap right now, as you can see. Quick race there. Let's give you your top ten rundown. Uh, besides uh, Zachary Taylor in the lead, Zach Lickinger, second, third, Madison Seaver, fourth, Henry Nova, fifth, Henry Buckeye, sixth, Eugene Maxim, Jeffrey Buckeye, eighth, James Qualls, ninth, Seth Cole, completing the top ten is Justin Tallentash. Let's give you 11th through 20th here. James Starfox, Dylan Ogo, Kyle Rose, Chris Dollarton, Cody Lamas, Devin Whitson, Drew Martin, Nicholas Guerra, Anthony Reese, Tim Walsh, and that's your top 20. And let's see, no indication of Zachary Taylor coming into the pits. That is what Zachary Taylor wanted to see, is that checker flag waving. And Zachary Taylor is going to come over and win here at Bump Drafton Super Speedway. Congratulations to Zachary Taylor on his first career high array Monster Energy Super Speedway Series victory. All right, we showed you your top 20 there. Let's give you your top 30. And it's um, 20 cars finished in the race there. Uh, J.J. Marks ended up 21st. 22nd is the 6th. I can't remember who that is. I think that's... Oh, it's Pete Shoot Diggy. 23rd is the outside pole center. Ian Klein. 24th is the 16 Kyle Fisnowski. 25th is the 06 of Austin Ogo. 26th is Jacob York. 27th, Jake Cole. And complete the, and complete the rest of the field. And 28th is Dylan Young. And here's the rest of the retirees. And 29th and 30th is Jeff James and Mike Flanagan. And the rest of the field there from 31st to 40th. And for those of you who don't know where you finish, I apologize. Just make sure you remember your number. I apologize for those who don't know. It's a, somehow Daniel Day and Jake Williams were stuck in the pit 10 laps down, which I don't know why. There's your look from 31st to 40th. And the last two are right there. So thank you guys so much for tuning in this race. Congrats to Zachary Taylor once again on his victory. One last time, and uh, we'll see you for the next race of the Ray Monster Energy Super Speedway Series. And don't forget to tune in to the Iron Royal Goodrich Harkness Series uh, for their next stop. So that's it, guys. See you later. I'm out. Peace. Your Trump and your ASL results. So see you guys later. Uh-oh, guess what day it is. Guess what day it is. Huh? Anybody? Julie, hey, guess what day it is. Oh, come on, I know you can hear me. Mike, 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 Mike. What day is it, Mike? <laughs> Leslie, guess what today is. It's hump day. Woo -woo! Ronnie, how happy are folks who save hundreds of dollars switching to Geico? I'd say happier than a camel on Wednesday. Hump day! Get happy. Yeah. Get Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more.